Right there. Here we go. Hello, daybreakers, explorers, and survivors. Welcome back to Edge of Eternity. I'm trying to remove the window, but it's not letting me. Hold on. Uh, wait. No. Any options? Graphic settings. Uh, let me move it last time. Why is it not letting me move it this time? Uh, Oh, uh, to to help when they want to look at the comments then. But right, so we're getting into this then. Seven eighteen, two twenty-two. Uh, I'll go with this one. This is Edge of Eternity. Uh, a dynamic event has been triggered close to your location. These events are dynamic quests that for a sh short time to appear as you travel the world. Some of them affect your personal story, altering future dynamic events that can affect the world. Cool. I guess it's that um, exclamation mark. Oh, there's a chest here. Ambrosia powder. Nice. So I'm kind of playing this blind. I did look for a guide, but I couldn't really find one. So um, I'm kind of just going as, oh, oh, hey, it's that giant cat from the trailer. Yeah, I'm just going with, you know, what I get. Um, I'll talk to you. Do you have a request for me? In desperate times, it's only normal to turn to faith for comfort, for faith feeds our fellow man as much as it sustains the gods. There are three headstones near the village. Each of them deserves a prayer. Go and see for yourself. The three pillars. Read. Th yeah, okay, yeah, you, you say the same thing, okay. Read the headstones around Inel. Right. <laughs> right a ways away. Well, I guess I'll explore the village. Uh, I'm not going to talk to everyone. Just um, uh, people who have quests for me. Because I don't want to spend too much time on this game. Because I know it's going to take a long time. Probably going to take a long time to complete already. I've got equipment. How do I? Ah, there we go. Leather um, armband. There we go. Also, we have sword justice. So you can select which item you carry with you in battle in the battle items menu. You can also set weapons instead of items, allowing you to change your weapon and your skills during battle. That's cool, honestly. You can swap weapons in battle. So I guess they, they were inspired by Final Fantasy X with that. Uh, there's lots of chests around here. Cushion. I guess the beds are like inns. Just did a whole... Okay. So that's the map. Uh, I guess this is more like a... Can I zoom in now? Uh, no. This is more like a thing I can do on my way. Oh, is that hunting board? Ooh. Hunt Dilu. The city of Heralsor is rewarding anyone willing to risk his or her life to track down and kill a very dangerous Dilu that has been sighted hunting nearby. There's a disclaimer in small writing in which the poster of this request declines all liability for whatever happens to the, to the volunteer willing to accept it. Kill, kill four Dilu. Hunt Crocter Cub. Uh, same text. Okay. Nice. Cool. So we have quests. Uh, tracking activate. Does that cancel the other quest tracking? Or yeah. Okay. Um. So I can't track 
multiple quests at once, which is a little annoying, but you know, I deal with that. Oh, sorry, Cynthia, I didn't even see. Howdy, finally able to catch a stream again? The word there is right there, why his or her? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I agree. Um, his or her always sounds like clunky and weird to me. Like you, you can just use they as a third person gender neutral singular pronoun. It's fine. It's been in use like that since like the eighteen hundreds. Okay, where can I teleport to? Um, nowhere apparently. And it also costs money to teleport. Your party has an energy bar. Each action, spell, and special attack in combat and when sprinting reduces this energy. Visiting an inn or a campfire will restore your energy. Your party can also have a food bonus. Obtain this bonus by visiting an inn. The lower your energy, the lower your food bonus. If your energy falls below 25%, all your statistics, food, equipment, and characters are reduced. You can hold A to sprint. Sprinting consumes energy in the stamina bar. The bar refills when you are not sprinting. If you continue sprinting when the stamina bar is empty, it will consume team energy. Uh, Cynthia. Nah, not even the 13th century is the first documented use of singular they. Oh, wow. Even that, that old. Sheesh. But yeah. That's like even less of an excuse not to use it then. I wish I could move this window. Why wouldn't it let me? It let me last time. Oh, well. There should be a Nekaru farm next to the village. Maybe I could rent one. Maybe, but you have some quests to do here first. Also, like, um, totally not chocobos, then. Nekaru farm. There's a quest there, too. I'm going to pick it up. Ah, there's two quests, actually. Oh, that's a Nekaru. Oh! So the giant cat things are Nekaroos. Hey. Wanna take a Nekaru for a ride? Cynthia, are they vibing? Yes, they are. Look, oh, so cute. Like big cat things. Maybe. They're not completely weaned yet, so don't try and take them too far. And to be completely honest with you, I'm not really comfortable with letting them out. Why is that? There's one of those gelatinous blobs lurking around here. And? Aren't Nekaroos fast enough to just run away? You don't much know about Nekaroos, do you? They'll nibble on anything they can get their paws on. So, like, Neko, like, Cat, and... Buckaroo? I, I don't know. Including Blob Gel. Problem is, it's rather harmless to us, but it's poisonous for Nekaroos. They die if they eat that stuff, you know? I'm not afraid of that blob critter biting them. I'm afraid the Nekaroos will bite it. Cynthia Kangaroo? Ah, yeah, that makes more sense. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't think of that. Tough life, Nekaroo breeder. And the guards tell me they won't do anything, since the blob's not a direct threat to anyone. So, there you have it. As long as that creature's out there, I'm not letting my babies out. You're asking me to kill the blob. I'm not asking anything. I'm just saying I won't let my Nekaroos out as long as that flabby sack of phlegm's on the prowl. So, are you saying I can borrow a Nekaroo if I get rid of that creature? You said it, not me. Purple whiskers. Let's see what else... We got another quest over here somewhere. It's 
way you could jump, but whoa, okay. Um, that's attack, I guess. I just like refamiliarize myself with the controls. I guess you can't jump. I thought you could, but maybe I was mistaken. Because it would be real nice if I could, you know, get over this fence. Justice. I already have that one. I have an extra one now. I guess I can sell it or give it to someone else if anyone else ever joins my party. I guess I have to go around the back. What's this? Dark seed. Ooh. So is this the blob thing or... No, that's a crystal. It's a pretty crystal too. Oh. You can go faster, but well. I thought it drained your energy, but it doesn't. That's cool. Okay. So there's no reason not to sprint then, I guess. World root. Itching wineberry. Here we go. What do you want? Cynthia, maybe only in combat. Well, you can't really move much in combat, but yeah, maybe. Something wrong? Which would be a good quality of life decision. Yes, indeed it would. The stupid fishermen won't let me go into town. They're afraid I caught the corrosion walking through a clockwork field. Hey, if you go there, tell Eden that I found and killed the croctor he told me about. Also tell him... Oh no, never mind, I don't care. I'm out of here anyway. If that fool gives you a reward, just keep it. Sure, thanks. Modern romance. Okay, so... Ah, there's a crocter cub I need to kill. Don't worry, I got this! You or an enemy receive damage. Skills and actions often deal damage to entities. When the enemy entity's HP reaches zero, the entity will be KO'd unless until the end of the battle or until they are resurrected with a specific item or a spell. It is now your turn to play. Select an action on the action bar and target an enemy to inflict damage. You bet. I know how to play. How do I make it? Uh, ah, ah, switch camera mode. Yeah, there we go. I'll be able to see my enemies. Also, I should probably move. down. Wait, no, it's still alive. Oof. One down. <laughs> Just pours it on his head. <laughs> Maybe lightning strike.
Oh yeah, I forgot that there are battle objectives as well. Oh, yeah, and your weapon also levels up. Cool. So is that one of the things? Yeah, so I just need to kill two more of those. And wasn't there... <coughs> yeah, thought so. I don't know if there's an inventory space limit in this game. Celestium. Ooh, is that maybe for crafting? Gemstone. Oh. Uh, yeah, there it is. Noon belongs to Anselm. He sits at the centre of the world and counts the deeds of Krator and Ilvana, resonating in his throat's manifold the tally of death and rebirth, a song of absolute harmony. Only the worthy can hear the many voices of the deceased, for virtue is a treasure conquered through pain. I want to I wanna get the item. There we go. Breast drawn. Okay, that's one. The other one is over here. Dodo Dillus. Yeah, I want to avoid that for now. Jing Weinberry. What do all these do? I don't even look at them. Let's see, Crystal. Energy of strength increase physical damage by 2%. Shining Shard. That's Lightning Strike. Could put that in there, I guess. I don't know. Oh, yeah, this is. So that's Speed and Resolve. That's Defense. And that's Power. So. Mm, I don't go for Speed. Lightning fast. So what do these do? Dark seed. Contrary to the name, these are not seeds, but incredibly small, hard mushrooms that only glow grows in the dark, evaporate when put under sunlight. World root, a small piece of an incredibly long root which has formed around all of Herion during the past millennia, forming one single giant network of roots. Itching wineberry, a small fruit famous for its taste, both sweet and sharp. Celestium, a unique mineral that when powered with crystals has a tendency to become extremely light to the point of floating. Dorsal tongue. Croctors are often found roaming in forests and nearby cities. Legends say they use their human-like tongue to lure humans their way. Threstron, a seeping root which transformed the ambient humidity into a thick substance. Cool, okay. Well, let's see what we have over here in the next... Shrine or headstone, rather. I think it might be up there. Not sure if I can get up there yet. Homunculum. A strange mineral which sometimes takes a humanoid form doesn't scream when it's pulled off the ground. <laughs> that would be. 
kind of creepy if it did. Oh, there's a, safe, there's a safe and teleport point there. Wait, no, it's further down. Or is it? You know how to? Ah, here we go. It's done, Ron. Oh yeah. This kind of feels like deja vu. Kill an enemy after each of the characters have hit them. Well, there's only one of me, so. Try lightning on these. Useful damage. Did the trick though. Take this. Nice. I did the thing, right? What's this? Tombstone. Lottie boasted she could stay underwater as long as she wanted. Is it okay now? Made your point? Come out now. We're getting so worried. Ooh. Poor kid. So can I not do anything with those? I guess not. Oko? Hello. Follow my lead and we'll get through this. You're the only one there. Darian. <laughs> see how you like lightning. Oh, they don't. They really don't like lightning. That's good to know. Cynthia says munch. <laughs> Got a new thing. This one, haste. Grenade, deal fire damage to all entities on the targeted case. Oracle tail, an oracle's tail mercilessly retrieved from its cold body. Ambrosia reed. A quasi-mythical substance grows only on the floating farms around Herosaur. Indescriptible taste. Yeah. I mean the 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 translation isn't perfect, but you know, dusk belongs to well, I say translation more like writing because I think they made the game in English, um, even though they're French. Dusk belongs to Krator, whose endless grief feeds the madness of the darkness. Each night, he tears the universe apart in the hope of finding his missing children. 
They don't belong to anyone. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Only by destroying the old can the new exist, for in the chaos of lost things lies the possibility of another future. Well then. Fellowship powder, itching wine berry. This should be a safe point. Uh, down here. If I can't find a way, I'll make one. Kill two enemies or more with a single action. Um, I don't know how I'm gonna do that. Uh, I think. If I move there, kind of let them come to me. Or maybe move to one and then let the other come, but that'll. Uh, that'll put me in a bit of danger. There. Okay. Now let's go here. I want them to be both on the same square. Perfect. Stay right there. Damn, I didn't slot the... Never mind. Can't do it anyway. But you have to slot items before you can use them. I was meant, meant to use a grenade, but... I cannot. Because I don't have it slotted, so... Unless this works. No. Okay. Remember to equip the grenade after this fight. Cynthia's stream's still going to be two hours or until the normal end time. Um, two hours is the normal end time. So yes, it is going to be two hours. Dunria's bone. The bone of a Dunria usually found in the meadows around Harosaur. In times of war, useful components such as these are never wasted. Yet. Oh well, it also meant the hour at which we stop. Yes, which will be 2am for me, just like normal. Cynthia. Oh wait, it's the fucking daylight savings or whatever. Yep. Okay, so I'm guessing it's up at the top of that cliff there. 
means I can't get to it yet. Cynthia, stream started and it was 7pm for me when I'm used to it starting at 6. Yeah, it'll be like that until the end of November. And now we have to do an ad break. God damn it, I feel dumb. Oh, it's okay. It's, it is, it's hard to, you know, sometimes it's easy to forget. Because your clocks go back at, at the end of November, ours go back at the start. It's weird. Ah, there it is. Wait, that's just... Is that new? Uh, that doesn't heal me, does it? I can't see my health, so I don't know. <laughs> Cynthia, sometimes it's easy to forget to take something in my hip no kinky brain. <laughs> 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 ah, Crocter Cubs. Yes, need to kill two more of you. Find a way, I'll make one. Finish the battle without using the same skill twice. Does attacking count as a skill? Um, also, yes, it did heal me. That's good. Oof. I should move. Uh, like one HP left or something. Oof. I have to use a potion. These things are tough. That should be. Yes. I'm guessing. Yep. Quest complete. What's this? Is that a crafting table? I can't do anything with it though. Right, let's get the headstone and see what else we can do. Kill some more of let's these. Perform attacks from behind. Hmm. How am I going to get them to turn around? I wonder. Uh, 
I go to here, let one of them come into the middle. Or maybe even here. Mm -hmm. Okay, I mean they're gonna attack, but I defend. Then I should be able. Oh, no, okay. Never mind then. way out of bounds here. Skip turn. Why? God damn, they're blocking me in. Motherfuckers, they've drilled me in here. get a chance to fight back. The heck was that? So I did that at least. Yeah, okay. I know how to open it. I know how to do this game, you You already told me. Enjoy this, nor will you. Build the mark to enemy first. That that one's the marked enemy. Okay, I'm going to defend and let it come to me. default to the one I just attacked. go. 
So that does something. Let me see. No, I thought it would take extra damage then. Ah, healing crystal. Ah, that's what they are. I mean, the enemies damage me more than it heals me, but still, it's nice to have, I guess. Or does it, or do you automatically heal after every battle? Is that what it is? I'll check. If I get into another battle. If I'm not in full health, then I'll just flee. I just want to test this out. Enjoy this, nor will you. Oh yeah, you you automatically heal after every battle, which is good. Finish the battle without healing any allies. <laughs> okay. Um, you're asking a lot of me there, game, but I'll try. Ooh. Stronger now. Hey. Repulsive bomb. Repulse all entities on the targeted case. I don't know what repulse means. Guess I will find out at some point though. Ah, Dillo, I need to heal I need to heal these, I almost said. I need to hunt these. Find a way. I'll make one. Kill any enemy in one strike. Not sure if I'll be able to do that right now, but I will try. Let's see how you like lightning. Yeah, neutral damage. Not 
too happy being surrounded like that. There's a healing crystal over there. I don't know what that is, but I think I don't want to be part of it. This is the only place I can get healing though, so I guess I have to stand this, whatever it is. Thank you for keeping me alive a few more seconds. Ah, I'm, I am in very much trouble. Oh, I, I do have a potion. Okay, good. I was like, why do I not have any items? But I do. Right. Get rid of you. Thin out your ranks a bit. Muscle of attrition, slow and steady. Down you go. Yeah, I couldn't do it. I, thought I wasn't strong enough. White calcite, when they are not busy eating other species, dodo dealers spend their leisure time licking crystals. Along with the calcified remains of the prey, they didn't even bother to chew. These small crystal particles form this dense mineral. Nice. Oh, Crocter Cup. I won't back down. Kill an enemy who is powered up by a crystal. You got it. Ah, so that's what those do as well. They power you up.
Bye bye. Oof. Let's see what this can do for me then. Boost. Defense up. Okay. Time to move. Smart well, doesn't want to come near me. Oh well. It's dead now, so whatever. <laughs> this is how I play RPGs. I take my time and I kill every enemy in sight. Now these are Don't worry, I got this. weak for me. Endure less than 336 damage. Well, I mean, so don't die, basically. <laughs> Thank you. I'll try not to. Uh. Cynthia... That's all right, whatever works for you. Yeah, thank you. Cynthia so says, play how you have fun. I do. Yeah. Thank you. Boost. Defense up. And you go. I feel like a lot of these Edge of Eternity streams are going to be very chill streams. Like, probably wouldn't require much, like, active watching. Like, something to have on, on in the background. As uh, Dilu. This kind of feels like deja vu. Hit enemies with the element that is their elemental weakness. I don't know what these are weak to, and I I can only do lightning or fire. So, um, unless it's fire, I'm kind of out of luck. And it's not fire. So, and that doesn't even count as like. Cynthia, yeah, I'm just playing Super Mario 3D Land. Nice. That's a fun game. Yeah. So I can't do the objective this time, sadly. So there's only one of them. Ooh. Weapons almost leveled up. Ah! Press complete. Hunt Dilu. Yay. I just get this um, headstone and I complete that quest. Dawn belongs to Ilvana. Each morning she rises to weave the world together again. 
Every time she does, she adds a new golden thread to the fabric of the universe. Thus, the laws that bind us all are born. Hey, Jack. You haven't missed much. I've just been running around killing enemies. <laughs> Jack Ilvana? Who's Ilvana? Someone I should know about. Ah, uh, don't worry. It means um, the other kind of dawn. This dawn still very much belongs to you. Jack, ah. Cynthia Ilvana, these nuts. What? <laughs> How does that even work? The Jack just did a key smash. Oh. Um. Yes, okay, so. Go home. I must get home as soon as I can. I hope I am not too late. Uh, so I did that one, I guess, because it's not showing on here anymore. <laughs> Jack says, what sense does that make? <laughs> you ask me. Um, so did that just count as completed then? I guess it did because it's it's not tracking it anymore. It's not in my log, but like I was expecting to like have to go back to the person who gave it to me or something. Uh, Jack, you need to work on that. I agree. I can at least go back and hand in the hunting quests. I got. It's now night time. Oh, ooh, look at the sky. Look at the stars. So pretty. Oh, wow. What's that? I don't think I've ever seen that before. Is that an aurora? It's, or a galaxy? I don't know. Wow. <laughs> Cynthia, do not question my machinations. They are beyond your level of comprehension. <laughs> Jack, all that. So that's pretty, yeah. Wow, such a pretty sky. <laughs> Jack just like these nuts. Oh. <laughs> oh. You you both are amazing. Save. The game. Where's that book? better idea would be to track this quest. Turn to a hunting board. It'd be nice if you shot up there. Okay. Cynthia says I wouldn't mind getting more of those nuts. I mean, what? <laughs> Fish. Ta-da. Navis Hunter. And Yay. Oh, hunt Dodo Dealus. Kill one Dodo Dealus. Sure. Bring it on. I've seen one of those around here somewhere. to curb <laughs> it sounds like my cat <laughs> honestly it does the noise it just made it sounds like nights when she's annoyed like <laughs> noise cool 
Like they don't attack you. They're kind of neutral enemies. They don't attack you unless you attack them first, which is good. It's a curb. Where is the Dodo Dealers? I saw one before. I know I did. That's the sound of it. That is the sound of a cat growling. There's Dilu, but like, those are the babies. I want the big one. That's the big one. Done on. There. There you are. Come here. Let me kill you. Level 9. Tough enemy. But we can take it. It's only one of it. Oh, ah. Follow my lead and we'll get through this. Missed the initiative strike. Kill the marked enemy last. Well, I don't think you have to worry about that. I need to move out the way very quickly. Let's see how you like lightning. Well, well, okay. <laughs> I may be in for a long battle. I'm also going to be moving out the way. Very fit quickly. Jack, looks like we don't have a choice. Are we insane? <laughs> probably. Good thing too, because if I were sane, I probably wouldn't ever attempt something like this. Anyway, it's time for an ad break. So, let's see, if I skip my turn, yes, it comes to me, then I can, attack, oh crap, 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 ouch, okay, that wasn't too bad, okay, the, Grass, the ground is on fire, help! I am gonna move out the way. I'm gonna move over here. You can come to me, I'm not going over to you. Good. Then I can move this way, avoid your tail swing. Ah. Oh, your back is to me. Nice. Critical damage. Move again. To avoid the fire. I think I can do this. As long as I can manage to keep moving out of the way of the attacks. Which I can't always do. But that's what I have these for. Ha. Aha! That damages you too! Silly creature. Burn in the fires you created. Uh. Okay, I'm just going to defend. And I'm going to defend again because... I didn't think I could avoid that. Ow, 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 ow. Uh, this is... Coming quite the predicament, isn't it? Might 
as well fight. My attacks are fast. Ooh. Is it not fighting anymore? I mean, sure. You've given up. Suits me fine. I'm not sure if this is a bug or if I've done something, but it seems to have given up. Maybe it ran out of MP. Oh, it works for me. Perish. Perfect. And there we go. Hunt complete. Let's get back to town and see what they want me to hunt next. Jack, well done. Thank you. I don't know why it just stopped attacking all of a sudden. My only guess is that it ran out of MP and therefore couldn't do anything anymore. Or maybe I was maybe I was blocking it in so it couldn't move. I don't know. It seemed like it could move though. Either way, it works for me, so I'm not complaining. <laughs> Cynthia says it was sparing you. <laughs> I wish. I don't think this game has a sparing mechanic. The only problem is like I'm holding down A to sprint, so I can't turn the camera. Because I can't like hold A and move the right stick at the same time. Yeah, okay, calm down, knights. <laughs> also, you can teleport, but it costs whatever those H things are, so and I don't want to use them if they're important, so Also, these, these things, uh, which which we saw in the trailer as well, are called Nekaroos. And they're basically this game's version of Chocobos. Yay, level max. Firebomb, ooh, nice. Burn all the entities on the target case. Okay, I did all the hunting board quests. Well then, what else do we have? There's another thing. Uh, modern romance. Let's do that one because I think yeah, that's that's close. Okay, this person right here. What the the crocter is dead? Who told you that? Huntress outside. You didn't know? Your fellow villagers wouldn't let her in because they thought she was infected with the corrosion. She did it in the end? I never thought she would. It's a long story. Sorry, not interested. I don't have time. I only bothered to tell you because I had to drop by an L anyway. Before you go, take this. It's her reward. Give it to her if you see her again. And if you don't see her, well, you can keep it. Complete. And lastly, purple whiskers. So what we have to do in order to... This is kind of... It's a side quest, but I think it's also a, a required side quest because if we do that, we can... If we do this, we can get uh, Nekaru to ride, which will help us with navigation. Also, I 
Really wish you could jump in this game. It would be so much easier. So nice if I could just jump over this wall, but nope. Uh, yeah, here we go. Also, my one of my golden rules with RPGs is never buy any equipment from shops. Because you always find some out in the wild anyway. So, it's no point wasting your money. Save your money for things that you actually need it for. Also because I don't really want to, I just don't want to risk like, oh, I buy a leather shield from the shop for like 200 gold and they, oh, there was a leather shield in the chest in the next dungeon anyway. Whoops. Yeah, that's happened to me way too many times. So now, so now I really just don't like buying equipment in um, RPGs. And you may say, but you're making it harder for yourself because you don't know if you're going to find the equipment. And, I, and to that I say, there. <laughs> I know. Ah, come on. I won't, back down. I won't do an initiative attack. Kill the Mark's enemy last. Again, I don't think you have to worry about that game. Honey. Okay, lightning has neutral damage. I mean... Guess that makes sense in some way. You. Thank you. I'm focusing on a speed build for loading poison. Ooh. Um, well, you're going to die before you can use it, so never mind. Jack Honey? What is this thing someone's pet? Maybe that's just the name of the species. What? New objective for quest. Talk to Inel's Nekaru breeder. Let's go and see them, shall we? Yeah. Like I know it's kind I'm kinda of making it harder for myself by not buying equipment, but yeah, just means I need to be better. Cynthia says, I'm your honey. Oh, I, I assume that was directed at Jack and not me, but still, oh. <laughs> and Jack says, yes, but you're not a slime. I mean, she could be. <laughs> if she wants to be. She can be whatever she wants to be. Yeah, look at the Nekaru. Oh, I want a pet. More games need a pet option, damn it. Oh, okay, why are you there, and can you not be there, please? Finish the battle without healing any allies. You ask a very hard thing of me, game, but I will try my best. Okay, so now it's going to attack. I need to move aside. Oh, you can interrupt it as well. I didn't manage to interrupt that though, but now it's back his turn, ha! Huh? Oh, and I can't hit it because I'm too far away. Ah, now it's back his turn. Critical. Move away from the fire. Yeah. Oh. There aren't any like crystals around here, and no. Well, yeah. 
that actually hit me. I, um, oh, jeez, I guess it did. Uh, uh, there we go. Ah. Sometimes the camera is a bit wonky in battles. I don't know why I ran into the fire just then. Uh, this is a jack you just took damage because you ran into the fire. Yes, I know. I just said I don't know why I did that. Uh, I can't do this without healing. Sorry. Jack says you need to heal like now. Yeah, I know. That's that the way. Yeah. Yes, I can actually avoid it this time. So soon, I made it like that. Because, so I can see the whole battlefield. I see like nothing. I just see like grass. But there's a Nekaru, that's the neutral thing. And there's the enemy I'm fight wait no. There's the enemy I'm fighting. And there's me. Yeah yeah. But, uh... Yes. Come on, come on. Why? I spec for speed. Why is I still slower than the enemy? Ha, yes, stand in the fire you created. Bye bye. <laughs> Jack, okay, Zemnus. Hmm. Shining scale. The scale of the most unfortunate Dilu, but they were threatening to eat you anyway. I mean, yes. How do I get in <laughs> there now? See, like, I wish you could just hop over this fence, but no, you have to go around. Done. Your Nakarus have nothing to fear anymore. You did it? Thanks. Why the long face, though? You look even worse than last time. Are you sick or something? I'm okay, thanks. So, the Nekaru? One of them has already taken an interest into you. Try and call her and she'll come in right to you. <laughs> they... Uh, yeah, they, <laughs> they didn't really, like, affect the grammar in this game. <laughs> She'll coming right to you wherever you are near Inel. 
But don't forget my Nekaroos are still young. If you go too far away from them, they'll try and come back here. They won't stray farther than Inel or Elon. No problem. And please, keep him safe, okay? Keep him safe? Yeah, don't worry, I'm good at that. Cynthia English? Yeah. I mean, it's, the game was made by a small French studio, so you can forgive a few mistakes here and there in the English. True champion. You can now call a Nekaru. Mount the Nekaru by moving closer to it. Yeah, to interact with. Or does it have to be? Is it any? Oh, here we go. And I. Oh, not you then. Okay, so we ah here we are. I think these ones. No, hello. Can I can I ride you? <laughs> Jack Kitty is bouncing and vibing. Wasn't that the one? It had a prompt at the bottom of the screen. No, it was the one next to her. Uh, no, that was that was prompt to talk to her, I think. All right. Twilight, yes, that's me. The first one, yeah, no, because yeah, there was a prompt, but it's a prompt to talk to her. Didn't she say something like mount with L? Um, I don't think she did. She said, like, it said move closer to, to it to mount it. Oh, there's a there we go. Just noticed that there was a thing on the side of the screen. What are you sensing? Oh, there it is. Yeah. Hey, that's my aunt Stash. Sorry, the Nekaru just swooped in and... Yeah, <laughs> don't worry. I was about to give up anyway. What about we share it? I'd never have found it if you hadn't come along with your Nekaru. Ooh, nice. Thank you. Nice. Be able to put, yes, yeah. it's on speed. Yay! That's cool, they can like detect buried treasure, I guess. Well, let's go home then. Back to the war zone, I guess. Oh, a 
What's that? What's that purple thing? something oh. I'll queue a bit further over there <laughs> alchemist I've gathered almost everything I need for my next batch of potions but I'm missing a few ingredients you look like the type who needs a little curative or three under your belt you have some itching wineberry by any chance I could start cooking right now and share my potion with you yeah I do great now I can get to work wait one hour and I'll have it done Ah, so it automatically waits one hour, that's good. <laughs> Jack. <laughs> Desperate, I mean, go on. <laughs> <laughs> it's something for you. Use it wisely. Oh, ether. Nice. And you disappear. I guess you got what you needed. Okay. Moving on. Oh. Kitty smells treasure. And the enemies like avoid you when you're on this as well, which is also good. An ambrosia powder. Baricitium. Uh, not an actual gemstone. This the sol solidified mucus of an insectivore monster injected, then forgotten, into an anthill. Interesting. Here we go. I'm going to leave you here then. See you later, kitty. That looks like a crafting table, but I can't do anything with it. I guess I have to wait for the tutorial first. <laughs> you don't see many lone mercenaries around these parts. I'm a messenger from the Red Falcon Company. If you're a messenger, where's your emblem? I lost it. Are you going to arrest me? <sighs> no, I'm not going to arrest you. I'm not here to do the consort's dirty work. But that doesn't mean you can get away just like that. You have to do something for me first. Blackmail? Call it what you want. Most of our men have gone to the front lines and we barely receive a third of our supplies. We only have a handful of tired soldiers scattered around the entire region to keep the area safe. If monsters overrun in L, it won't be the consort's fault. It will be ours. Cynthia, Super Mario 3D Land conquered. The first half of the levels anyway. Nice, good job. The second half is way harder, so good luck. <laughs> so yeah, I'll do whatever it takes to make the region safe. Oh, thank you. I hear you. Further up the path behind me, you'll find an Alpha Oroko. It hasn't attacked anyone yet, but that won't last forever. It's only a matter of time before someone gets their head bitten off, and I can't afford to have any of my troops wounded. I don't mind dealing with it. I have to go through there anyway. 
so let me go and I'll take care of it. All your Nekaroos there, pal. You'll get slaughtered if you go there like that. First you need to get some Morocco traps. Cynthia, oh I know, I played it when I was a child and it came out in 2011. Me, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't need those. Doesn't matter what you think. I don't want your death on my conscience. No attacking the Oroko until you're properly equipped. <laughs> Let me guess. It's up to me to find the Oroko traps. Did you turn what you did earlier? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, um, so earlier I was watching um, a stream. Have you switched it? So earlier I was watching uh, Elder Scrolls Online live stream and um, they were talking about like how you could vote for them at the Game Awards and there was a like thing on the screen with a big button that said like vote now and I tried, I tried to click the button on a Twitch stream. <laughs> yeah, this is the Twitch stream live now on Twitch. So yeah. I was, I was like, I was like, oh, it's a big button. I want to click it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Jack's is silly. <laughs> I can't help it. It's like a big button that says "vote now," and I was like, oh, I just want to click the button. <laughs> um, oh, <laughs> Cynthia says "bimbo." <laughs> Takes one to know one. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Jack, I think they design traps like this with you in mind. <laughs> yes, they do. Uh, uh, mm, uh, thank you. Cynthia, oh, I know I played it when I said that already. It wasn't good enough to collect the star coins, but now I'm doing a 100% run. Nice, good luck. I did that once. It took me a long time. Whoa. Yes, that was the world ends with you. Uh, I thought it sounded familiar. Um, let me show uh, what I got on the tasty treats. Hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah, because the big button on the box and beat just presses it. Yeah, I remember now. Nah. No, time for an ad break. I sent one of my men to craft some traps. He's in a clearing near the creek. I just hope you got to it and has enough to give you. By the way, you need a better cover story if you don't want to wind up dead. It's a good thing you're in the ash end of Astria, let me tell you that. Ah, uh, I'll think about it. Think about it? You got a death wish or something? Very funny. New objective request, homeward bound. Speak to, to, speak to Troy. Save while I'm here. Hey, come, Kitty, let us away. To adventure. Or at least to this guy who's making traps for me. What are you here for? 
the traps. The captain asked me to destroy the beast on the road. Ah, so the captain put you up to it, did he? Good man, such a softy. He'd prefer to throw a total stranger into its paws than risk the life of one of his soldiers. What can I say, pal? I'm sorry. It must be tough being at the bottom of the food chain. Whatever. Where are the traps? You caught me in the middle of gathering them. I still need about two handfuls of itching wine berries. Hey, how's this for an idea? Why don't you go and gather the rest? I don't have time for this. Hey, if running errands isn't your cup of tea, I've got another solution for you. What solution? We caught two bandits the other day. They're our prisoners now. Why don't we feed them to the beastie? They'll make a hearty meal. Once its belly's full, maybe it will go away. What? What did you just say? <laughs> See, she's pissed. Yeah, I guess having seen three of his friends die, he's probably not so keen to see anyone else die. Whoa there. By Kratos, holy vagaries, man. That was a joke. Lighten up. Man, you're scary. What's your problem exactly? Where can I find the berries? Jack, yeah, probably not the best joke to make, yeah. There's a good spot for gathering them, not far from here. When you see the bushes, hit them with your sword and then bring the fallen fruit back to me. I'll head back to camp and start cooking with what I have already. Make sure you really strike those bushes hard with your sword. That'll help you release some of that nervous tension. objective find Troy at the encampment I guess I already have tons of wine berries so hmm. Jack what's your problem exactly I have an anime pro tag with a tragic backstory and at least four dead friends. And how is that different from any other anime style RPG pro tag? Just give me the damn berries. <laughs> yeah. Here's the stuff you asked for. How is the crafting coming up? Hey buddy. You wouldn't believe what happened. I just hurt myself while crafting the traps. My middle finger's hurting like hell. I can't make anything. Hey, I got a bright idea there. Wouldn't you mind crafting the Oroko traps yourself? Cynthia bonus points for being white, cis, het, and male. Yes. Well, um, we don't know about het, but yes, the other things. Admit it, this was your idea from the beginning. Come on, my finger's hurting. How about some sympathy here? Here's the blueprints. The workshop is right there. I'm sure you can get it done fast. Ah, yep. Told you. There's going to be a crafting tutorial. <laughs> Jack, I don't know, Cynthia, with hair like that on the hat part. I mean, yeah, good point. Unlocked recipe, Oroko trap, a cruel mechanical trap that triggers uh, interact with the crafting table. Uh, whatever you say, game, select Oroko trap in the craft item list. Craft Oroko trap. Nice. Exit crafting menu. <laughs> Did the hat until proven fruity. That was easy. Open the status menu by pressing Y. Select items in the left panel and press A. In the status menu, you can change which items to... Yeah, we know this. Let's say it's the first slot. Select a rocker trap. Close the menu. And there we go. Speak to the captain. So save. 
I'm gonna save often. Save regularly and save often. I know those mean the same thing, but you know. Traps are done. Troy, didn't I order you to do it? I busted my middle finger and that's all the compassion I get? You look tired. I'm fine. Now that I got the traps, let me add it. Sleep first. It looks like you haven't had a good night's sleep in a long time. Yes, we want you fresh and rested. The monster likes its meat tender. Troy, will you shut up? Jack. Oh, don't worry, Troy. If you hurt your middle finger, I'll give you one of mine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Nobody likes my jokes around here. Go to sleep. You need to be properly rested before you face that monster. <laughs> Objective. Go to sleep. Sure. <laughs> Cynthia says I'll send him back to Troy Jack, oh look it's me every week now <laughs> Objective, go to sleep Yeah When your energy bar is low, or if you want to change your food bonus or see character scenes, you can rest at an inn or by a campfire. Only inns can provide a food bonus, but campfires are a way to restore your energy during expiration. Cynthia Mood. Select your wake-up time and confirm. Um, 10, I guess. Okay. Jack, the one superpower from video games I wish I could have IRL. The power to sleep for an exact number of hours. Yeah, that'd be awesome. I just wish I could have, like, the power to, like... You sleep for one night and, like, you're completely healed. Like, all injuries gone, no, no sickness, no anything. Just perfectly fine and healthy. Once you're ready to fight the monster, come and tell me. The moment I've beat it, I'll leave. Got it, Captain? I gave you my promise. Now, are you ready to rumble? Bring it on. Then good luck to you, young man. If I can't find a way, I'll make one! Trap damages the enemy and causes bleeding. Nice. It's up to scan your foe. Scan is currently showing information for Darian. Yes. Press right bumper to scan the next entity. The panel now shows general information about your foe. Nice. That's kind of cool. Press right to reveal more information. During your turn, the scan allows you to check information about your enemy, state alterations, positive and negative, weaknesses, resistance and skills. Jack, oh interesting, it's like a big hog. Yeah. Bleeding inflicts increasing damage over time that can be cured by healing. Don't hesitate to use the scanner, especially if you have some doubts about your character's skills or need more information about buffs and debuffs. Cynthia, I'd take shape-shifting as a superpower, personally. Yeah, the classic trans power. Every, every trans every trans person, you ask them, what what superpower would you most like to have is always shape-shifting. Do you like lightning? Not much, I see. Is 
Cynthia, I'm boring, okay? No, not boring at all. Just because something is common doesn't mean it's boring. Cynthia, if not shape shifting telekinesis, that would also be fun. I think I I I choose tell I choose um Jack, I don't think we even needed the trap yet. <laughs> um uh, like top three powers I would choose are shape shifting, of course. Um uh flight, um like free flight and I really want to say mind control, but um, uh, and I, I don't know, that would be kind of immoral. I, I think I would, don't want to be trusted with something like that. So um, I will go for Jack says I pick either hydrokinesis or umbrokinesis, oh, like controlling water or controlling shadows. Nice. I, li I love those. Yeah, me, I, I do like... Um, uh yeah shape shifting um flight and teleportation fine work now that's done i'll be on my way if you're going to Elon, just take the path on the left and... No, I'm going to the mountain. Well, you won't find anything there except the old witch. The old witch? Oh yeah, you don't want to cross her path. Hey Cap, tell him what she did the other day. Jack, I'm a bit basic on the shadow versions of powers that pop up in games, like Fireball, eh, Dark Fireball, gimme. I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm with you, like, Dark Powers, like, when you get to use Dark Powers in video games, that's always awesome. That's why I was so excited, like, when you can, when I could finally play as Riku in Kingdom Hearts, because he's like, the Dark user, and it's like, yes please give me because like normally it's the bad guys who use dark powers so, so like to be able to to play as a like a hero who uses dark powers that like yes the like, give 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 me that yes please um like dark is not evil is honestly one of my favorite tropes as is light is not good um especially when they're both used together Hey, Cap, tell him what she did the other day. Troy, shut your clap. Well, the other day she passed through our camp in her cart, kicked out two bandits she'd captured, and gave us the scolding of our lives. I thought I was clear. I don't want to hear it. Oh yeah, she just went on and on. She was still talking at sunset. She thought it was our fault the bandits tried to pillage her farm, see? Oh, and the part with the rake. Troy, I told you to shut up. Let's check Troy seriously, take a hint, yes. So she brought a broken rake with her and shoved it in the captain's face. She wanted to know who was going to pay for it. Why? Because she broke it catching the bandits. I did your job, she said. You should buy me a new rake. Oh, please. Captain just caved in and gave her the money. And money for the chair she broke on their heads. And money for the rope to tie them up. <laughs> she took him to the cleaners. I'm too kind for my own good. Too kind, that's for sure. Jack, oh well, yeah. Lucky the priestess was there or she'd have broken our noses with the remains of the rake. The priestess? How long ago was it? Jack, well, I mean, Captain was generous at least. Yeah. 
Let me think. Four days, maybe? Five? Four days. <laughs> hey, why are you laughing? She's still alive. <sighs> Thank the gods. Ooh, she might be still alive. Astrian continent, Elon village. Twinned with Musk village. Leo, you lose your last snail working in the fields. And it just dawns on you. Is enough. Not again, Mom. I don't care if I lose a few years because of the corrosion. It's okay. For the first time in my life, I can stop and contemplate things. Contemplate what? What I've done with my life. You're probably still angry that I sent you to the convent, but... I'm not angry. But I'm glad I did it. I saw a chance for my daughter to become more than a frog girl, and I took it. And here you are, eight years later, a real sanctorium priestess. I've done something worthwhile, something that will make the gods happy. So, I can die. No regrets. Are you finished? Yes, that's what I'm saying, darling. I'm finished. Listen, I'm sorry to rain on your funeral parade, Mom, but you're not going to die. Oh, I bloody well know that I am, Celine, and you need to make peace with it. I won't make peace with it, and that's the reason I came all the way here. To tell you that we found something. There's a cure for the corrosion, and we will find it. We? And what do you mean by we? Don't you dare bring Darren into your scheme, Celine. He's capable of deserting over something like this, and you know it. Well, it's too late now. Too late? I already sent the letter. You did what? Did you even think this through? Do you know what the consort does to desert us? Believe me, Mother. I've put a lot of thought into this. I know what I'm doing. You always think... You know better than anyone else. Because I do. By the gods. Is this about the voices? It's not about the voices. Is it about the voices? You swore to me that you weren't hearing them anymore. It's not about either of us, Mom. It's about Darian. He needs to know. I kept it a secret for a good reason, Celine. If he deserts because of you, because of this... His death is on your conscience. <sighs> He's not going to die. And neither are you. Trust me. You sacrificed everything for us. Broke your back, fell sick, the gods know how many times. Now it's time for us to repay the favor. There's no way we're letting that thing eat you alive. You might be ready to give up, but we're not. I'm not. You don't understand anything. I didn't save you from the gutter so that you could throw your life away on a fool's errand trying to save me. I know how it works at the Sanctorium. Every second you waste here, you slip out of someone's good graces there. I won't let you waste everything because you're scared of losing me. My choice is already made. Go ahead. Waste your precious time running around the country looking for an inexistent remedy, Celine. Even if you find it, I won't take it. I'll force it down your throat if I have to. That's not how it works, Buttercup. You're not living in a fairy tale. There's no cure for this. Not if I have anything to say about it. When the pain is too much to bear, I'll throw myself on the rocks down there. And everything will be right again.
Uh, Jack, it must be musky, and God damn it, why you stole my joke. Eh. Uh, Cynthia Sillies. He, Jack, oh gosh, her hand. Yeah, she's infected. Famous last words, indeed. Cynthia, oh hey, a claw, I just noticed. Yeah. Jack, geez, that's dark. Indeed, well, you know, what What would you choose? Um, suicide or being overcome by an infection that turns you into a monster? I mean, yeah, it's dark, but... <laughs> I think I'd make I'd do the same, honestly, if I was in that situation. Ah, good a safe point. I think we'll stop here. I know it's a couple of minutes before, but you know, the game gave me a safe point, so I might as well take it, right? I don't know when I'll get to the next safe point, so better earlier than later, I think. So this is Cynthia, isn't that the plot of Bloodborne? Um, kind of. Not really. I I think. I don't know. Anyways. Yeah, where am I going? Exit game. No. Exit game. There. Yes. Ah, <sighs> uh, feels good. Okay, so that's all for today. Look forward to more of this tomorrow. Till then, stay safe, daybreakers. Love and peace.